Olin with us right now to break down the NBA playoffs. The Western Conference has been filled with intrigue all season long. The Thunder, they clinched that number one seed just yesterday. However, the West is still crowded with contenders. Aaron, what's catching your eye about that first round in the Western Conference? So from a betting perspective, it's interesting that some of the higher seeds are actually favored to go on and win the series. So the Dallas Mavericks are one of those teams. They're minus 120. So much drama in the West with the playoffs unfolding. I cannot wait to see what we get. As Erin Dolan, you can catch more of her analysis on ESPN Bet Live on ESPN2 at 6 Eastern. Thanks, stay. Tyler. It's now time for EKD's top three, this time a baseball edition. Here's what I believe you need to know before betting into baseball today. The public is loving the Dodgers on the money line against the Nationals. They're an absurd 360 favorite against Washington. They're getting 94% of the tickets, 97% of the money. Tyler Glass now is on the bump for the Dodgers, and he's a perfect 3-0 this season. Plus, betting on the Dodgers in his starts would have you up four units. He's the most profitable pitcher in baseball this season season. Now let's get to a trend that's a little less happy. The Miami Marlins are off to a terrible start this season. They're 3 and 13, the worst record in the National League, and they're also 4 and 12 on the run line, the worst record in baseball. The game is literally starting right now and they're a very slight underdog at minus 105 against the Giants. Now, as for a play that I'm liking for today, no surprise, we're going to Philadelphia. We're taking the Phillies on the run line against the Rockies. Colorado is 2 and 8 on the road, but 3 and 7 on the run line. And by the way, the Rockies have been terrible as a team throughout France franchise history on the road, so this isn't just a small sample size this season. Cal Quantrill's 344 batting average allowed is the fifth worst among qualified pitchers, and if you're looking for a bonus play, Kyle Schwarber to hit a home run might be one you want to take a look at. He has three homers and 11 at-bats against Quantrill. So that's a look at the top three things I believe you need to know before betting baseball today. Tyler, what else you got?